When we look at a political issue such as health care reform, the question for the health care industry isn't who's winning in Washington, it's what's going to happen to my business, to my employees, to the investments I've already made in my company. Calorama Information has a particular specialty in the in vitro diagnostics or IVD industry. So we decided for that industry to answer the question, what will be the impact of U.S. healthcare reform on the IVD industry? There are a number of provisions in the U.S. health care reform, the Patient Protection and Affordable Care Act. And the ones that are most popularly known are the individual mandate where Americans are required to buy insurance or face a tax penalty, and the coverage for those with pre-existing conditions. But there are a number of provisions that are more silent uh, provisions in the legislation, and we looked at this. One, for instance, is the prevention of nosocomial or hospital-acquired infections. Another is funding for prevention and wellness. And we think those will be positives for the in vitro diagnostic industry because it's a testing industry. There are also some pitfalls in the legislation that might hurt the industry. There's a new tax on medical devices. And most IVDs, if they're not a purely chemical nature, are considered medical devices, so they'll face that tax. And there are cuts in Medicare reimbursements, which might impact the industry. Calorama Information has a long history, two decades long, of looking at the in vitro diagnostic industry. And one of the features of this report is that there's a procedure count in that. We examine the number of procedures in IVD now and what it might be in the future as millions of Americans get insurance that they did not previously have. The report estimated that the IVD industry, absent any kind of legislation, was probably going to grow at 3.2%. We think the legislation will boost the IVD industry, but not exceedingly so, by about 1.3%, so 4.5% growth over the next five years. There are some segments of the IVD market that will perform better than that, and some that will perform worse. Some companies really stand to gain from the legislation, and some will see no difference or might be affected by the negative aspects of the provisions. These are things that are detailed in the report. For almost two decades, Calorama Information has been publishing detailed market intelligence studies for the biomedical industry, with a specific emphasis on the diagnostics and biotechnology sectors. Each Calorama report is constructed from the ground up with primary and secondary research, including in-depth interviews with executives, clinicians, and industry experts. Calorama's North American-based analysts have extensive experience in the industries they cover, and their reports provide the essential market data with meaningful segmentations and forecasts, key competitive intelligence and insights into the trends shaping the market's future. 